Hello everyone, welcome back to Spiritual Lux Oracle. Thank you for your likes, your comments, and your subscribes. So I know y'all are wondering what is up with the background. I tried to do the reading on my little favorite cliff view, but it was way too windy this morning. So I just recorded it and I figured I would record the voiceover reading. Okay, so enjoy the view. <laughs> okay, so this download i got it last night and i kept hearing it um thinking of all the ways to romance you and then i hopped on pinterest and it was nothing but romantic pictures i was like oh somebody's person this is going to be very specific this is going this is not going to be for everyone because i'm getting for some of you you have a strong hold on this person but y'all could be in separation okay this could be someone um I'm not going to say from your past, but someone that you have history with, okay? It could even be someone that you are already married to for some of you, okay? Or establish some type of union. I'm hearing um, five years, okay? Five to seven years, so five, six, or seven years that you've known this person. But I'm getting y'all had a strong hold or a, um, I'm hearing a bond, okay? And I'm seeing Mr. and Mrs. Smith, so y'all could be a little toxic, okay? But y'all could be past life lovers and y'all are meant to come together in this lifetime to work things out okay or not work things out but like get through more lessons but i'm getting it's like y'all are tied energetically by something here okay this could just be a soul tie or it's almost like y'all are tied because unbeknownst to y'all y'all want the same things y'all y'all crave each other's energy or y'all's y'all crave or y'all desire each other something like that here it's like it's like even even if you don't know that it's this person it's this person that you want yeah ten of pentacles okay and vice versa for this person it's like this person could have known what they wanted but they didn't picture you as that and it's or i don't want to say it like that but it's like it's like it's you that they're manifesting it's you that they're wanting it's you that they are picturing and it could have been a surprise or it just is something about something was hidden in this connection here but with four of wands and ten of pentacles as the first cards out the first spread it's crazy because this person sees a high level commitment a um power couple connection with you here and someone feels left out in the cold at this time yeah page of cups someone could have been acting childish here okay so that could be why this person is thinking about all the ways to romanticize you okay this person could want to apologize or this person could just want to show you a different version of them a better version of them a more romantic version of them Ooh. king of cups in reverse three of cups and ace of swords oh yeah so this person acted like they did not care about you that they did not have any emotion for you okay they could have celebrated elsewhere had a third party elsewhere here and yeah i left you i'm hearing high and dry or left you feeling left out in the cold and you decided to walk away but this was very hard to walk away from because with this two of cups energy and the ace of cups y'all could have started off very strong you could have thought it was going to manifest into a higher level of commitment with the hierophant coming over here but we have the tower and then we have the ten of cups under this okay so for some of you this is not over for others of you you walking away is aligning you to this ten of pentacles ten of cups relationship okay that is going to be very fun y'all are going to be celebrating i'm seeing um sinesta okay sinesta is a hotel so like this person could be thinking about yeah justice queen of swords this person could be thinking about um um like booking a hotel or doing something romantic here but there's something going on with justice queen of swords and the five of swords there's something sneaky going on surrounding this justice surrounding this queen of swords so i'm gonna tap into it and let's see i'm gonna tap into it spirit allow me to see what this five of swords this justice and this queen of swords is trying to tell me at this time
Ooh, Ten of Pentacles and the Two of Cups and and disunion. So someone could have brought a disunion or brought an ending to a foundation here, a romantic or a family dynamic, a family foundation. Shoot. Yeah, and then the King of Cups kind of came out in reverse again. And I say kind of because I, I picked it up kind of sideways, but it was pretty much in reverse. So it's like this person is holding back emotion at this time or this person is not acting off of or acting logically when it comes to their emotions. Yeah, Page of Cups, not very, not really in tune with their emotions and acting cold, dis, disheartening or like. I'm even hearing dishonest. Yeah, what is this spirit? One, five of Cups, Ace of Cups. So we went from the Ace of Cups to the Five of Cups. It's almost like something got pulled out under the rug from this person. Could it be this Queen of Swords. Okay. Could be a family member. Could be older in age here. Yeah, Ten of Cups. It could be this person is walking away from a family member or someone older in age, someone they were taking care of, who have, this person could have had a negative attachment to this, to your person or this person, and now it's bringing the tower because it's like, this person is destined for a Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles with you here. That's the truth, Ace of Swords. So it's um, so they're getting rid of negative attachments for this union because they know this union has crazy potential. Yeah, and back to this message of thinking of all the ways to romance you, okay, to get you back for some of you, okay. They could even be seeing a, a practitioner. This person could have just found out that someone did something deceptive or distrusting, okay? Or this family member could have been distrusting to this person, okay? Trying to hold this person back from a Virgo or a Empress, a Libra, okay, someone who they were passionate about, someone who they wanted to co-create with, who they wanted to celebrate with, someone who they've already partied and co-created and celebrated with, okay, someone who has heavy passion for them, or they could have been holding them back to only give this Knight of Wands energy, to only give this Page of Pentacles, to only act on passion, okay? Not really giving the Empress what she deserves here, okay? Because you can't present an Empress with Knight of Wands, Page of Pentacles, and Ace of Wands. What the fuck is that? That's like sending somebody a drink and not saying shit. Like, okay, thanks for the drink. Get the fuck out of my face. Like, you know, like, do you not know how to communicate, okay? Okay. Are you just going to hide your emotions? Are we just going to celebrate our way to the top? Like, what are we doing here is what I'm getting. But it's like something behind the scenes could have been holding this person back from moving forward here, okay? Or holding this person back in general. I'm hearing in life here, okay? Two of Wands. Yeah, this person has a high calling as well. This person is supposed to be working. I'm hearing working this foundation, okay? Establishing the vision here. Okay, but it's like they've been held back and they have to cut these ties. And I think they're choosing to cut these ties. Okay, and I'm, I'm thinking you're going to get quick communication about these ties being cut and, this per cut and this person is going to offer you something that has to do with a financial, um, a, a financial stability or foundation like moving in like sharing resources like giving you resources here okay as an apology or just as a way of getting back in your good graces here with queen of swords and king of 
next king of swords y'all are definitely yeah y'all could have been someone could have been obsessed with y'all's connection or obsessed with trying to make the connection not work or just telling this person that it won't work telling this person to cut you off but it's like you are a divine counterpart and it's like no matter how this person comes at you you are able to match this person's energy in some way and so they feel like um you're able to I'm hearing you're my treacherous little twin and you know that we locked in. It's whatever for you. Okay, so it's like this person is feeling like it's whatever about my person. Okay, this could be a twin flame. Let's get some divine truth and close it out. You're my treacherous little twin and you know that. Yeah, and love card just popped out. Okay, so there's nothing stopping this love. Ooh, knight in armor. It's nothing stopping this person from coming towards you as well. Yeah, illusion. It was a lot of illusions put up in this person's life. Distorted. Making this person act distorted. Okay? Act out in distorted energy. Yes. Enchanted. This energy. Ooh, planning. Listen. <gasps> I'm ending it there, y'all. Twin flame and planning just fucking came out. And I just split. I mean, I just lifted the last card in the deck of the right of way and the fucking hierophant. So you are about to enter a love contract, a higher level of love, a commitment, okay, with your twin flame. But I'm getting it's still going to take some time. I'm seeing up to six months because this person is still trying to get rid of these illusions and they are still kind of in night energy. So they not like it's going to be um, immature action that you're going to know that this person wants you, but them actually being in their full blown divine energy like like making i'm not gonna say making plans okay because this person could make plans before six months but establishing everything like to the point where you just feel ultimate safety ultimate security in this connection i'm getting give it um at least 20 weeks wait up to 20 weeks 20 to 24 weeks i'm hearing Okay, so just let every let all the cards play out. Let everything play out. Okay, focus on you. Focus on your foundation. Whatever, especially dealing with the twin flame. Whatever you want your twin flame to implement more, do that to yourself more. Okay, do that to yourself more. Implement more in the connection. Okay, or implement more within themselves. If you want your twin to go within, go within. Okay, so I will see y'all in the next one. Bye.